Hello everyone, as promised, we're doing the uh, Hamilton Beach Professional um, um, Dicing Food Processor Review, uh, or a demonstration actually, so we did the unboxing already, you guys can check that out on my YouTube channel. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to shred some cucumbers real quick, so we're going to put the shredder blade in there, and accompany that with, put this on top when the lights are flashing. That means it's not ready yet, so you have to have everything in place and then it'll start flashing. Lock this in place. Ready to go. So what we're going to do is just take some, uh, some cucumbers here and we're going to shred these up. So we're going to put it on slice, shred, and knead. It's not very loud. Cucumber here. Put this back in place here. And we'll get that uh, one more. Looks like I shredded it nicely. I'll take that out. I'm going to make a little yogurt, uh, yogurt salad with that. We got one more cucumber here, so we're gonna head and start our machine. And we actually have a smaller. Uh... Oh, I gotta go in there. So use that one. Slowly push it down in there with our plunger. Okay, so let's see how we did here. A couple little pieces left up there. It's not too bad though. Very thin slices. Both by eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Two, pull the blade out. So have these little um, finger holes. So you can just pull it out like that. And let's see what we got. So those are um, sliced up nicely. I'm gonna go ahead and pour it in this bowl here. Put that right there. And just so all those are nice and uh, uniformly cut. in there and then we're gonna make a salsa next so try to get as much of this out of here as I can it's fairly easy a little bit in the salsa is not gonna hurt anything so there's the um, shredding as you can see that is uh, nicely done it would have been a lot uh, been quite difficult to do that by hand that quickly and the machines um, it's not very noisy, I noticed, so that's, that's kind of nice. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we are going to uh, grind up our cilantro and some chilies here. And we're going to get our salsa started. So we'll put this, uh, put this blade in here for chopping. Get these things out of the way there. There we go. Okay. Here. No. I'm gonna feed it in there. Okay, and lock that in place. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna feed some of this cilantro in there, and I'm gonna get put it on the 
mix. So now we're going to remove this blade and we're going to dice up some the rest of our ingredients for the salsa. Put that off the side. Okay. So what we have here next is this uh, contraption. I'm not sure what the technical term is, but when you put this in here, you want the uh, the uh, chopping dice. <sighs> Wow, that, that look uh, facing towards you. And you kind of feed it onto there. And just be careful because this, uh, this is super sharp. So that goes in like that. Is that correct? I think. Yes. Yes. And this is going to go down over that. Just we want to handle this by the by the middle here because the blades are really sharp. So that will go down in there. And then you lock these metal tabs in place, and that pulls the blade down. Okay. And then you put this back on top. Lock that down. Bring up your handle. And let's see what kind of a. Uh, Will this fit in this one, or do we want to just use the big nozzle here? So we can use it, uh, use it like this and plunge it down, I believe. So let's go ahead and... It won't start until we have this down there, though, so... We can throw an onion in there, maybe? throw it in there. No, whoops. It says we can just put it in there. I'm going to try. I'm going to try to just throw it in here. Up to this max line here. Um, and there's two right there. So. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and put the slice dice, knead, and shred. Start that. <laughs> sure your little uh, metal activator here gets pushed into there and go start that up again. Now we got uh, tomatoes and stuff.
there. Nice. And lift up the top here. Okay. Put that in there. See what we got here if we lift up the uh, blade. Good, a little bit of stuff left over. We need a special little tool here. It has uh, this thing. Wash it off real quick here, give it a rinse. Okay, and this we can use the, I don't know if you can see. Uh, let me get a little closer here. So the holes are plugged a little bit, and we can just use this to kind of uh, push those through. Like so. really sharp there. Okay. That is that. Now we'll take a look and see. Sorry about the, the shakiness there. You can pull this out of here. Nicely, um, everything is uh, diced in there, so that's pretty nice. I like my salsa uh, chunky, so you can see that everything is neatly diced, and I'm pretty impressed with it, actually. It would have taken me a while to do that by hand, um, so it looks like it works as advertised. There was a... We'll come back and do a review. Um, this is kind of my review, but you know, we'll, if we try something else, so another blade or something, we'll we'll show you how that works. But that's the uh, the slicer and uh, the dicer, and I'm pretty happy with the results. And uh, now we're gonna have some salsa. So thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great day, and uh, stay tuned for more reviews, fun, and games. Bye.